Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm filming a very highly requested video. I'm gonna be showing you guys my wildflower cases collection. Before we start, I just wanna let you guys know that I will have a link in the description for 10% Oh my god. I will have a link in the description for 10% off. It's just my referral link, so I basically get credits every time you guys use my link. So if you do end up wanting to get a case after this video, use my link in the description so I can fuel my wildflower case addiction. All right, first up, we have the iPhone 6 Sweethearts case. This is my old iPhone 6. It is cracked. It was my first phone ever. This is the only iPhone 6 case that I still have by them. I had two others. I had the watermelon one and the like emerald one. They were both really cute, but I ended up selling them when I got my next phone. Then I got my iPhone 8 Plus. This is the next one. This was the first case I ever had for it. It is the Jordan Jones case, and it's like opalescent, which I think is really pretty. So in like different lighting, it changes colors. I don't know if you guys can see that, but I remember thinking it was so cool. I only have a few of my iPhone 8 ones still. All the other ones I think I gave away to my friends once I got my next phone, but I will show you guys the ones that I do have. I have this black cherry case. Love this one. It's super cute. Next up, we have the case that everyone was obsessed with. At least at my school, almost every girl I saw had this case. I think it was super popular because Emma Chamberlain had it for a while. I do think it's really cute. It gives me clueless vibes. I love their plaid collection. Um, but yeah, this is the blue plaid one. I don't want this video to get boring because all I'm doing is showing my cases. So I'm trying to move through them kind of quickly. Next up, we have the, uh, I don't know what this is called, like the monogram case. I think it's supposed to be kind of like the Louis Vuitton logo, but it has a little WF instead of LV. I got it in a random Urban Outfitters in San Francisco. It was kind of an impulse buy, but I do not regret it because it ended up being like my favorite case that I've ever had for this phone. I even considered getting it for my next phone, which I will show you guys right now. Those are all of the iPhone 8 cases that I have left. Like I said, I gave all the other ones away to my friends when I got a new phone. This is the case that I currently have on my phone. I think it's my favorite one that I've ever owned. I love it so much. I just got it a few days ago for my birthday. I just turned 18. I just got a notification that Wildflower Cases added to their story. Of course, I have their notifications on. I also also signed up for their text so I know when oh my gosh they just posted the case that I have on right now <gasps> wait they just released it 30 minutes ago. Oh my gosh. I don't know if you can see that. I'll have a picture of it on the screen. It's called the Butterfly Sky Case. It's so cute. Um, Back to the video. This is the mushrooms one that I have on my phone right now. I'm obsessed with it. All right, next up, I have the Antonio Garza collab case. I feel like so many people had this one last summer because of the whole like Visco Girl trend, but I think it's so pretty. I love the background and I love all the butterflies on it. Next up, we have the Dragon Case. This was another super popular one. It's kind of an old one. This was one of the first cases I got for this phone. Um, um, it's super scratched up and the little like WF emblem fell off at the bottom one time when I dropped my phone Usually it would have one of these right there, but this one doesn't because I'm clumsy next up is Oh my god <laughs> The guy from my high school just walked by <laughs> moving on sorry about that So this case probably looks a little bit familiar. I was like so emotionally attached to this one that I got it again I don't know why. Next up, oh my gosh, this is one of my favorites. We have the Neon Flames case. This is the green one. I'm obsessed with this one. It makes me feel like that one girl from Kim Possible. I'll put a picture on the screen, but I love this one so much. It, oh my god, it just makes me feel powerful. I don't know why. It's just so cool. I really like it. I'm also obsessed with the color green, as you can see by my green shirt, my green nails. <gasps> I literally just got a text from Wildflower about the new case that they released. I recommend signing up for their text because they also text you when there's sales and a lot of times they do like $24 for 24 hours like this and then they text it again. Oh, and then this one was just released too. I don't remember what I was talking about. I know it was this case, but I do not remember what I was saying. So I'm gonna move on. Next up is another Flames case. I was really into the Flames cases for a while. I actually have another one that I'll show you guys next. This is the light pink one. There's also the green one that I just showed. There's a black and pink one and then they just released the purple one that I just showed you guys. Here's the black and pink flames one. I have a pop socket on this one. I kind of miss having a pop socket. It's really handy. The only reason I don't use them anymore is just because I don't want it to like cover the case. Ooh, It would be kind of cute if I put it on this cow one. Might as well just show you guys that one next. This is the cow case. I think on the website it's called the moo moo case. But yeah, I think it's really cute. Cow print has been super trendy lately. It has been for a while now actually, but yeah, I really like this case. 
base. They also have a pink cow print at Urban Outfitters. I think it's like an Urban Outfitters exclusive. That's a good tip though. If you do want like a more rare wildflower case, look at Urban Outfitters because they have some that are only sold there. I don't think I have any of those, but they're pretty cute. Next, I have the Latte Love case. Another one of my favorites. I've said that about probably like four of them now. Doesn't even mean anything at this point. This one is the angel one. I don't know exactly what it's called, but I feel like this was another super popular one for a while. I can't remember what these are called. It's gonna bother me. I need to look it up. Cherub, that's what they're called. This was one of my early favorites when I first got this phone. Next, we have the strawberry case. This is actually another one that I had for my iPhone 8 and I bought it again because I loved it so much. They also have one that's similar that has like a light pink background and it has cherries instead of strawberries. That one's also really cute. I've never had that one, but I have wanted it. Next, I have this case. I don't know exactly what it's called. I know it's a collab case, but I don't know the girl's name. This one is so cute. I didn't have any like pastel yellow ones. I don't think they even sell any pastel yellow ones. Maybe like one brighter yellow one, the Saturdays one. But yeah, this one is adorable. I love the little flowers on it. Last but not least, we have the flower power case. I know I've said this about a lot of cases, but this one is actually probably one of my all-time favorites. Besides this one, these two are my favorites. I'm just obsessed with this one. It screams like 70s and it's so like bright and it's colorful. Kind of reminds me of that 70s show. So I think that is about it. That is my entire wildflower case collection. I'm obsessed if you could not already tell. Again, make sure to click the link in the description if you want 10% off. This is not sponsored in any way. Oh my gosh, I wish it was. But the link down below is just like my refer a friend link. So yeah, I think I'm gonna end the video here. If you made it up until this point, comment mushroom. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. It would really help me out. Also, if you wanna follow my socials, the links are always in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.